I'm gonna try to see if it's. Whoa, dude. Who are you, bro? Oh, shit. Wrong What's car, up, bro? bro. Yo, Uber? Nah, bro. What the <laughs> fuck? Get out my car, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get it. So, uh, how hot was it, like, when you first ate it? How that happened? It made me feel like I was from the fucking snot came out my nose. I was fucking crying. I tried to drink some milk. <laughs> you know what I mean? Turn around, look. You end up ordering a whole nother meal. Don't waste your fucking money. Plus, you'll fuck your high off. Like, See, you'll fuck your high off. You'll fuck your high off over no fucking buffalo hot wings because they too hot. You heard it here first. So, currently, they're scared to get an order. Bro, I'm just trying to get some wings. All right, y'all, we back and we came through with the motherfucking hot wings. So basically, these are the hottest wings that were out there. Dude, I can smell it, bro. Like you open the box, you just smell it in the room. Oh, oh in, the, fuck. in the car, I smell guess. It, bro? Oh, you didn't get a good whiff. <laughs> no, I got a whiff. I got a whiff. <laughs> yeah, shit. I, I smelled it from way over there, bro. <laughs> it's just nostril burning, y'all. So we better fucking try some of these. I say, um, hopefully we don't die. We got some ice cream. It's probably melted as fuck, but we'll just drink it. And then oh <laughs> we got some water. Oh, yeah, I got the water down right, here. Then. Where's the ice creams at? I think. Oh, they're right there. It's on the bottom. Oh, wait, what the fuck? Where's the bag? Oh, mine's right here. Yours right oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. I was All like, right. wait, what? So, we're about to eat this. Stoner versus food, y'all. You know, this is crazy. Should we roll up first or what? What do you think? I'm asking. Off camera, or you're just gonna start biting into a wall, roll up, and you start talking. Yeah, I'll shit. do. I'll do it first, so and like then yeah. I'll tell you what you're. Uh, All right, Mike. I'm gonna roll this joint, bro. I think you should. Uh, you should get into the food first. All right, y'all. Mr. TSC will be right back. Yeah. See what you do your thing, man. Okay. All right, y'all. We got this hot ass wing, yo. Let's just get it. Fuck it. Not too bad. You're not freaking out or anything, so. You know what? When it sits on your lips. That's on my lips? It'll, yeah, that's when. Oh, no, what I'm just saying, if it sits on your lips, that's where I think it, uh, it'll really kind of start fucking with you, you know? You're doing good, bro. You're doing good. You got this. Yo, this is the hottest fucking wing I ever ate in my entire life. <laughs> like that? Bro, that shit. Goes to your brain. This one he was playing. But I gotta do it, man. Stoner versus food. This is how you. This is really stoner versus food. Cause like, you can't finish this shit. Like it's versus. Like, who's gonna win? The stoner or the food? You did. You're about to order some more. Some more, right? And the dude was like, nobody's gonna finish them. Yeah, I was trying to order nine of them, and he was like, he asked them if they, um, if anybody's, like, ate that much, and he's like, I haven't seen anybody ate that much. <laughs> so I was like, I ain't gonna be the first one, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't that intense with this shit. You'd be the oh, first one in the hospital. Now it's on my lips, bro. And it just fucking burns. Bro, you're only on the first one, you gotta chow that down, man. I had an A1 bite. Maybe put some ranch on it. Oh, fuck. This is fucking hot as fuck. Oh, damn. That shit burns your throat. 
<laughs> Dude, you're like a check. sweating in here now, bro. There's sweat coming out the pores of your nose, like the side of your nose right here. You got, you got sweat. You know, the guy said you gonna feel it in your nostrils. <laughs> Oh, I think I'm joking. almost done with this one. Yeah, I, I see someone point. eat the whole fucking thing. I was like, damn. Poor wing. I need to eat the fuck out that wing one time. There's three. Whoever eats the third one. I mean, there's five. So whoever eats the third one, right? Because we can only eat two. Let's leave one. Whoever eats that third one, man. True stoner, bro. Stoner competition right now, bro. Whoever can eat the third. Stoner versus food. This competition has nothing to do with your ability to smoke weed. So round one, y'all. Um, I beat it. So I beat it. I beat it. What? <laughs> round one, I, I I completed the challenge. <laughs> and then um, he's about to get his round one done soon. And then, damn, my bad, y'all. You can't even talk right now, man. Spiced up. One day later. <laughs> <laughs> like so, that shit. <laughs> right, uh, I know I'm gonna have to pop the ranch one time, you know what I'm saying? Did you ever get some ranch action? No. Why? See, it's gonna be less harmful. Nah, bro. do you see that? You was gotta your do fault. one without ranch. That was your fault. Uh, who told him not to eat? <laughs> <laughs> he's getting like, he's like, why, I, why is he trying to make rules last minute, bro? Just because he decided not to eat his ranch. He's over, there, he's over there sipping ice cream, like, no, no. No ranch. Alright, man, look, I'm gonna go for the biggest, juiciest one, you know? Alright. The trick to this is to like try not to get your lips all over it, cause that's what will destroy you. <laughs> it was all over my shit, bro. Oh gosh. He's using ranch. He's cheating. I'm a genius. I'm gonna try that. Let's see if it's more cool. It's probably not. Hey, it's a sneaker though. Where's all the napkins, bro? You took all the napkins. I left on one fucking napkin, bro, and we got like two. What the hell did it keep on? You see any others, bro? She finally come out with a samurai sword. This ice cream hit it. I told you guys, keep it off the lips. And use ranch because that's gonna help you. My tongue's on fire. It kinda like sinks in. I don't think it's an instant like. But with that being said, jump into the next one, bro. All right, I'ma just go in, y'all. Let's get it. Let's get it. Shout out to the homie Peter. Huh? Some more ice cream. Yeah, just get in there, man. Don't even think about it. <laughs> Don't think about how much it's burning exactly. your your lips right now. Your if tongue must be on fire. If it does, if you do that, I I can just see it on your lips, bro. It must be on fire. Like sweat's gonna start coming out your forehead. I don't know how you're chilling. This shit is nice work. I made me drool all over myself. Whoa. Stoner versus food, round two. I did that one. Because I gotta make sure to clear everything off, you know? Hell yeah. It won't be fair if I don't. He's hiking using a napkin to wipe it off. Hell no, nah, come on, bro. <laughs> I just get it. I don't, I don't chicken on that little. I'm holding the bone. Damn, that shit was intense, bro. That one was way more intense without the ranch. Oh my god. I 
Alright y'all. No rants. I'm a savage. Damn, what the fuck did you text me? Bro, you could literally like, probably die off these hoes, bro. Mm. Oh god, bro. Your stomach probably explode. I never cried off of eating something, bro. Or maybe it's sweat. <sighs> Alright, y'all. So, this was episode one of Stoner vs. Food. If y'all want to see more, or maybe do more of wings or something. No, dude, we haven't been smoking, smoked a joint. I know. Oh, shit. We're about to smoke, too, right now. But if y'all want more of this, make sure y'all drop a like at how much likes should we get to for the next video. You're sweating pretty bad, man. Bro, that ass will kill the fuck out of me, bro. Ah. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Dude, his hands are still like full of just the drip. Just. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, yeah, my, stomach, really my stomach is like still just like trying to figure itself out. Yo, that was the most intense swing I ever ate in my entire <clears throat> life. Like, my whole face is burning somehow. Yeah, I, I, it's just mainly on my lips right now. Bro, you're sweating, Bob. We're about to smoke right now. Oh, damn, if it's hot. I'll put so some of the uh, wing sauce on the joint. Hot sauce on this joint. Oh, fuck, bro, this is not cool. It's like they put ghost pepper in this shit. They got you, but like, oh, it's Mike. Extra, extra, extra hot. They saw the cameras, they're like, yeah, we're gonna get him a show. We're gonna get him a show. Ah, yeah, this was the craziest wing challenge ever. This yeah, was dude. so crazy. My lips are on fire, but I honestly, it's only because I only ate one without the ranch. Because when I ate it with the ranch, it was easy, bro. I still have it on my lips. That's why, bro. I was like, what the fuck? Well, dude, you, you were fucking making out with the damn wing. <sighs> Yo, let's just smoke. Hopefully, I'll get it off my mind. Look, I still have ice cream. <laughs> He said, I'll get it off my mind, bruh. Uh, Danny, go inside and get you some napkins, bro. I'll be right back. Mm. Get it here? Bro. Oh, yeah, you Gucci, you Gucci. Nice. You know when you need them back up napkins? I don't think I get it all of them, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that was so intense. I can't wait to smoke and just... Relax with y'all, maybe talk about some things. We should do like a, a little a mini topic. story or something. Yeah, well, what about uh Bro that's as hard as fuck. Appreciate it. Yeah, like fuck my artist. Fuck my artist. That's so hard. He did my calf and shit too. Motherfucker, he got bars, bro. <sighs> he got bars. Uh oh, how do you feel being a YouTuber now? Do you feel any different to when you weren't a YouTuber? I think that a lot of old friends. Like, they wouldn't hit me up, right? This is the only thing that really changed. <laughs> fake friends. You're saying them? Yeah, pretty much fake friends, right? They wouldn't, like, hit me up. And then, uh, I kind of just, like, grew out of that. And I started YouTube. And they, they like, saw I blew up or whatever. And they're hella in my DMs and shit, like, almost every day. Like, people I used to know. <laughs> talking about, like, oh, we are best friends type shit. And, like, we, or even people, like, that are ops and shit, like. So a lot of shit, like a lot of fake love that I hard to get used to. But the beneficial things is like, I'm happy for what I do. Like, I can't believe from when I started day one that I would get to where I'm at. You're recording off your phone, right? Yo, straight Android, not even a fucking iPhone. Like, and it was like, not even 720p, I don't even think some of my videos. Like, but y'all fucked with it, like, thank y'all so much, you know, like, y'all, y'all the reason why I'm, I'm chasing my dreams, continuing chasing, like, I have bigger dreams now, you know, like, I already accomplished these dreams, now I want these dreams to have. So you would say that overall it's just, like, dream come true type shit? 
definitely a, a drink or two. I think so many people would love our position today. People talk. People remind me about the all time, like bro. People would love to be here, doing this shit. You know, having companies hit you up and meeting with people and shit, smoking, smoking weed all and day, getting paid to do it. Like that shit's so crazy. Never thought that would be my job. I want to be a strain tester, fam. Get paid for that shit. How's that sound? And then nice. like every day do like a strain review. All right. That'd be so dope. Then you got the rollies, y'all. Put that filter in there, too. Come on, bro. Mr. TAC is... That's that uh, Cali joint. You know what I'm saying? Mr. TAC is certified. Oh, flavor, right? I love smoking joints, man. Like, you just taste the weed. That, that's some good-ass OG right there. Tapatio Kush right there. That shit. I'm still burning as fuck, bro. Tapatio Kush. Oh, I dropped my napkin in my water. All of them? You used all of them for real. You weren't playing, bro. Yeah. Bro, you're not burning? How do you feel? Um, You must get recognized all the time in LA, right? Oh, yeah. It's That's crazy. LA's popping like that. It's crazy. Yeah. And I'm all the way from fucking Texas. People are like, Young Mike. I like in my car and shit. I'm like, whoa, what's up, bro? It's fucking tight, yeah. Or like even at the store, like, you know. Venice, bro. I can't even walk to Venice. I've done so many videos in Venice. Like, I feel like all my people be there. Oh, yeah, because your base is kind of out here, right? Yeah, all my, my main audience is from LA. That's so cool. I want to take over LA. But like, you know, you're not from LA. So like, what do you think about your city that you're from? It's fucking, it's a small city, bro. You either trap or pimp. If you really trying to buy. Facts. And that shit was like, I see where it ends. Yeah. I was telling that to homie the other day. I was like, out there, it's either like, you're a trapper. Or like, cause there's really no rappers out there. So you can't really be a rapper out there. There's a lot of trap stars where I'm at. Pimping, bro. I bet you pimping is hella hot out there, bro. I bet you. Bro, I'm still dying out there. I but think not, that third one hit me so hard, that third hit me. I feel like you gotta leave your city though to really grow, like get uncomfortable and shit. Like, be somewhere you, you don't have no friends and shit, you gotta make friends and you gotta like really build again. I know this has nothing to do with that, but fam, that lady looks like off a scary movie. Where's she at, the one down there? She's been coming back and forth like multiple times, huh? She looks like that one, like, like say they die, and then like she'll come and haunt you with her baby. The trippy shit is she's putting something down there, like she's been bringing shit. You ain't see that shit? She's been just stashing shit down there, bro. Whoa. Yeah. So how do you feel being a uh, famous YouTuber? It's tight, bro. Things like a fucking blessing to not have to work like a job. I'd rather wake up at whatever time I want and just work on my computer and record and shit than have to fucking go work or to wear a tie and shit. Yeah. Fuck that. That's the best part of me, bro. Just not having to have a job and inspiring people, bro. Because motherfuckers see this shit. This shit's inspiring as fuck. I think all my fans were like collab with Mr. THC and then I saw your comment, but then I was like, oh, this is Mr. THC and you had long hair at first, huh? With blue hair? Bro, that was, I had to have like less than 30,000 subscribers. You had long blue hair, huh? And that's when I saw your picture and I was like, oh, this is Mr. THC. So then I clicked your, your thing, your comment. You commented on something, I forgot. <coughs> and then um, I was looking and then I saw your channel. And then ever since I just like kept up. Lit. Yeah, people really thought we were like real life funking, bro. I had people from Tiger's like, Oh, be finished crazy, it. bro. <laughs> yeah, like. That we thought we were really my, yeah, fuck. I'm like, yeah, oh, fuck you, bro. How I see it, bro, is like, we're all like, we should all be like one big family. There's no room for that, you know? Like, there's. Yup. We just all need to get our money. There's no room for beef in. And if we're gonna beef, do it beneficial, you know, like what we did. <laughs> Basically, bro. Yo, we got 100,000 views on that video I posted. Like, instantly. Nice, like, nice. That was some shit. Like, that was cool, you know? But yeah, I mean. In a positive way, like, you know, like, we just connect. You don't got to beef, all that shit. We can all eat, bro. Yeah. That's what's cool about this shit. But yeah, man, it's, YouTube's a trip, bro. It's definitely better than a job, though. It's like a roller coaster, though, huh? Oh. 
Oh. <laughs> it's up and down. Mm-mm-mm. It's a hell of a... I noticed that since I've been doing this for like a year. So, you too. You too. You've been doing it for a year. Have you noticed yeah. it's like a roller coaster? It is, bro. That's just like a real life roller coaster, though. Because like you, you got to deal with real life, you know? Yeah, that's crazy, bro. I noticed that. Like, it's just it's just so wild, bro. But you got to love it, you know? It's your it's our job. Yo, that shit will teach you about life, though. Like, you'll learn to be a person and shit. Because that shit will make you lose and, like, you got to learn to lose and shit and get up. So tell me this, can you see yourself doing any other job? Nah, nah. What about you? How I see it, bro, is, I don't know, I can't picture anything better, you know? I think that, like, it's not even a job. Like, I just love to do this. I love to see comments. It makes my day. Like, they're like, oh, we fuck with the videos and this and that. I'm like, dope. And it makes my day, you know, it just goes by good. And I don't know. It's just something um, cool. Nah, I can tell, bro. I, I mean, that's what you blow up so quick. Yeah. It's all about, like, the energy you put into it. That's what you're going to get out. What kind of gas is this, man? Some OG, bro. She's on some chronic. It's good, huh? Have you heard of OG Kush? Of course. Interesting. I'm about to say, it didn't say. Dude, fuck. ask me if I've heard of OG Kush. It's like asking me if I've heard of Sour Diesel. Or if I've heard of, like, Gorilla Glue. It's just, I think those are, like... Everybody's like old ass motherfuckers so will this. be like, I smoke go G. No one, no one <laughs> has it around no more, right? Right, right. Not like the original, like real, the real, real, Kush. real Kush, yeah. I haven't found it, fam. Like, everybody, like, I got so disappointed the other day they had some OG Kush, some company gave me. And then it was not the real OG Kush, fam. Hmm. Because you know, it has that certain smell. It's that OG. Hey, yo, that Venom OG, though, was real. Certain smell. That Venom real OG. Such, it was crazy. Oh. Yeah, because you be popping at, like, 15, you're going to be on some crazy shit. And, like, at 20, <clears throat> you're going to be made 10 like years in the game. Yeah. 10 years in the game. And you're going to have, at, like, life, bro. It would have taught you so much. Because you got to have that, like, believe in shit in yourself to be a YouTuber. Yeah. Like, like, people are hella awkward, bro. How many people don't you see get shy as fuck the second they see a camera? Like, automatically be like, Oh, that one came out clean. I did. <laughs> Bro, my shit is burning still. You're not burning? <coughs> it's not even, like, it's just like all right here. Yeah, I'm not on your level, bro. It's crazy, bro, because I hit them up from a small little page. And they're replying. Verified Instagram accounts. To be honest, fam, I'm still burning this fuck. My bad. That's why I'm like... Like, I'm hitting this joint, and it's like... This shit's burning my tongue. It's weird. (laughs) That fool's still... That shit hit me, bro. I think it was the third wing, bro. That shit knocked me out. Tough, huh? So, if how much likes should we get for the next one? Turn on your post notifications. <laughs> huh? For real. I don't never miss say a that. video. I should say that now. I think, like, yeah, never miss a fucking video. Good looks, Mr. THC. Whoa, look at that. Oh. You saw that one? Still going. Oh, that shit's gone. It's smoking here, man. This is the hot box. The real hot box. Hello. Stoner hot box, you know what I'm saying? And if y'all like enjoyed this video, if y'all want to see part two and y'all want, I'll like order more of these <laughs> or like we'll do something even more crazier. <laughs> what do you want to see? Just tell us that. How about that? What do you want to see? Let us know what the fuck you want to see. Period. That's it. Well, fucking make it happen. Okay. We're ending this video. Gang.